Now, I have no knowledge who could have played such a prank. Now, clearly, it was somebody trying to discredit my work, or why would they have chosen my presence at the time to commit such a hoax? Well, that's an awfully convenient rationale, Mr. Champion. Reverend Champion. And what church ordained you as a reverend? God ordained me. I see. I see. So then you denied that the mysterious monster had anything to do with you? I denied, absolutely. Well, then there was no devil. And these aren't the final days of the world, and whether someone avails themselves to your services or not has nothing to do with them being swallowed into hell. God works in mysterious ways, Mr. Cartwright. Though the prankster wasn't the devil, he reminds us of his evil and the coming of the end. And yes, the need to repent and be healed of your sins. Now you, you would do well to avail yourself of my services, young man. Free of charge. I ask no money for my miracles. But you accept it. Get out. Father. I said, get out! Now, you two. You gonna find that imbecile brother of yours now. Placement patients. If you D.W. Champion. Excuse me. Don't you think you owe these people an explanation? I beg your pardon? What do you think you're doing, Adam? Getting to the truth, brother. Well? I thought we cleared that up this afternoon. Not for all these folks you haven't. Well, as my father said, God works in mysterious ways. Yeah, sit down and shut up, kid. Yeah, go on, get out of here. And now, D.W. Champion. <coughs> Father. <clears throat> Brothers and sisters, the Lord wants us all to be whole in your body and mind. The blind and the lame went to him in the temple. Oh, get on with the healing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, get on with it. Oh, yeah, that's what we're here for. Who wants to be first? Don't you I wanted to do it? I went my Oh, hang on. <laughs> well, what's your name, brother? Horace. And you've been blind how long? For far too many years. 
Now we beseech thee, Lord, heal thy brother Horace. And the Lord speak. It's a fake! Fake! Faker! Gotta get better, brother. And we're all gonna stay right here with you until you do. Adam. Do you remember the time Hoss taught little Joe how to fish? Oh, yeah. And I caught my own behind. <laughs> and, and how about the time we jumped in the pond so the bees couldn't get us? And the time that you and I helped little Joe make his first jack-o'-lantern. <laughs> You said those seeds inside were worms? <laughs> I remember that. Remember that? And that time you made Big Dan say uncle. Thank you. 